Isabel. I hope everybody is doing well and welcome back. Um, okay, so today I am going to do a review, um, a first impressions review, and then I'm going to go throughout the day to see how these products hold up. And I'm going to do it on the bombshell collection of CoverGirl. So, so this is, these are the products I'm going to be using. Um, from this collection, I got the lipstick, and this color ooh, is in Ratch. Yes. And then I am going to be using the Intense Liner, Bombshell Intense Liner. And they're not open because the first impression. <laughs> and then this is the Shine Shadow. And the uh, Bombshell Volume Mascara, Big Sexy. Okay, so the I'm going to see how it works throughout the day and I'll periodically come and let you know how, you know, how it's looking and how it look, you know, and how it holds up. Um, I got these at Target. So the first thing I am going to do is put on the... Bombshell Shine Shadow, and I got this in the color Lilac. I love Lilac. Purple's my favorite color, you know. Mm -hmm. Okay, so here's the, here is the package, and I'm going to open it, and it's a cream. It's supposed to stay for a very long time. Stain Lightweight Formula has reflect pigments to add depth and dimension that stays sexy for 12 hours. So, okay, let's see if we stay sexy for 12 hours. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to prime only one eye. And I'll leave this one with no primer. So we'll see how that works. So I'm using Urban Decay Primer Potion. And I am sorry that I am a little puffy today. I went out last night for pizza and cocktails and it, the next day I always get like a marshmallow. <laughs> oh, sorry about that. Okay, so we're going to open this. All right. Okay, so here's it's the little tube. I can see that. And let's try. This is without primer. Okay? And so this one's going to be with primer. See how that looks. <laughs> okay, here. Okay. So the next, we are going to do the uh, eyeliner. This is the Intensify Eyeliner. It's supposed to be good for 24 hours. So we'll see how this works. I don't think I'll wear it for 24 hours, but, you know. <laughs> okay. And this is what the packaging looks, the little tubey looks like. I like that, I like the felt tip thing. Okay, so this is what both eyes look like. And then we're going to, the mascara has two sides to it. The one side is for volume, and the second side is for in, um, intensifies. Okay, so let's do this side first. And the wand, this wand, is more like a plasticky wand. I'm only going to put it on one eye. I know I'm going to be walking around like that, but I'm going to do it for you. Just for you people. You, you, you. So, one big, the reason I'm doing that is because I want to see if, this, if the um, eyeliner flakes. And I'm not going to tell if it flakes if I put... If it's the um, mascara or the eyeliner. So I'm not going to put any mascara on this eye, just on this eye. Okay? I know. I'm going to be freaky today. 
<laughs> so here we go okay so this is number one is on my eye my eyelashes here okay unfeak it today okay so number two this is what the wand looks like a number two it's smaller it's longer so let's see okay so this is with number two on let's put this out here I don't know if you could tell the difference okay so next one is the Lipstick. We'll see how this works now. Isn't that, that's really pretty. This is in the color Ravish. Oh, it's really, really creamy. I will check back with you guys periodically today to see how uh, it's going. All right, so right now it is 11.43. 11.43. And I'll check with, back with you guys in, in a couple hours, okay? Bye. See ya. Okay, you guys, it is now about... Uh, 145 it's been about two hours since I put on my makeup um, and the mascara is getting a little bit um, transfery down here so I don't know if that's because um, it was from just applying it and then it did that because it was a little wet um, but we'll see but the, the lipstick still looks pretty good I mean it's it's not as creamy as it was before when I first put it on but I mean, the color is still on there, which I really like. And as far as the um, the eyeshadow goes, I mean, I don't think there's any creasing at all on the eyeshadow, either on the one that's got the primer and the one that doesn't have the primer. And the liner seems to be going on strong too. So, so far, so good. So, okay, I'll check back with you in a little bit. Okay, you guys, it is about 5.30 in the evening, and um, my lipstick is pretty much worn off because I have, um, I've already eaten, so I think I ate it. Mm. <laughs> Anyways, the, um, the, as you can see, the, um, the eyeshadow, the cream eyeshadow looks really good on both sides. I mean, there's no creasing. And I didn't uh, do anything, you know, pat it or anything. And this one here, the this is the one without um, primer. And I also, with the eyeliner here, the eyeliner looks like it's staying on pretty good. Now this one here, the eyeliner is good. I, I do have some smudging at the bottom here from my mascara. And um, it has been smudgy. You know, not too bad though, but just, you know, a little bit smudgy. So, uh, okay, I'll check back with you at the end of the night. It is about almost 9 o'clock at night, and I'm ready to take off my makeup. So, I'm going to show you what all, what happened with all of this. Now, if you can see that this one here, remember I put the primer on this one and not this one. So we'll start with the eyeshadow. The eyeshadow held up really, really good. I'm really impressed with it. Now the one with the primer on it is like, like I just put it on. I mean, there's no creasing, there's no fading on it at all. This one here has a little bit of separation and a little bit of creasing. But for me, that's really, really good because I, I have really oily lids. Ew, that sounds kind of gross, huh? I've got oily lids. <laughs> Anyways, whoa. <laughs> Anyways, um, so, you know, for me, this is really, really good. This is pretty good. Um, 
Now let's talk about the eyeliner. The eyeliner is really good. I it didn't flake and it didn't like smudge or separate or anything. So that is really good. It's on and it's not going anywhere. So that's a plus. And the mascara, mm, I don't. I'm a little disappointed with the mascara because. Normally, I don't have like the raccoon, if you can see it, right? The raccoon right here. I'm looking over here because it's my viewfinder. But you can see the, the smudging that it did. And normally, my mascara doesn't do that. Um, and that is like a big no-no for me. I, you know, yes, it makes my lashes long. And yes, it thickens them up. But as far as smudging, I don't know. It's not going to, you know. Mm. Now, the lipstick, I really like the lipstick as well. Um, I like it. It was on for about uh, five hours before you could tell that I didn't have any color on my lips. And that's a really good thing because I ate and, you know, I had to drink. And I was really careful, you know, not to really... You know, dab my mouth too, though, you know, because I did eat. But anyways, but it's all off now. But I really, really like it very, very much. Um, I got these products for, at, like I said, I got them at Target. I got the lipstick. Oh, I think I got it for about $6. The uh, the mascara, I got it for about $8.94. Um, the liner, I got for about $8, $9.00. And uh, the um, this thing right here, the eyeshadow. Sorry, it's late. I'm tired. It was about six ninety nine, seven dollars around there. Now, for me, I would really recommend this. The eye shine, the the eyeshadow shine. I love it. Um, it stays on your lids. It's really nice if you're just in a hurry and you just want some color on your lids. You know, you put it on with your but I do recommend you putting on a primer though um, because usually I don't, like I said, I don't really do that good with uh, cream eyeshadows because it does, you know, it does separate and it does, um, it just gets icky. But this one seems to be doing really, really good. I'm impressed. This is a thumbs up for me. I would buy this again. The, um... The eyeliner, yes, I would buy this again as well. It's a really good eyeliner. It stays on. It doesn't, you know, and, and I love the, the felt tip on it. Um, it looks really good. And yes, I would buy that again. The lip, the uh, lipstick, it's in my, it's, I don't know, it's in my purse. I had it in there. Um, I would buy that again, definitely. It's a thumbs up for me. It's very creamy. It's not um it doesn't feather um and it lasts a very long time now i would not for me no i would not buy this again i'm gonna use it you know because i bought it and i'll, I'll use it um but i'll, I'll have to clean it because today i didn't do anything i didn't i didn't wipe or anything today so i looked kind of dorky going around you know with this on my eye. So anyways, you guys, I hope that was helpful. And that was my review on the bomb, on the bombshell collection from CoverGirl. And uh, I hope it worked out for you guys too. Let me know what, what are your thoughts on it, you guys. So thumbs up for my video, you guys. Um, and comment because I really want to see what you guys think about it. Okay, and remember, subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.